What's going on, guys? I just wanted to talk real quick for a second about uh, Duke and Coach K. Uh, now, Coach K is on, on pace. He is actually tied right now with uh, Bobby Knight for the most uh, wins in uh, men's basketball uh, in the history or whatever of men's basketball, college basketball. Uh, so, you know, I'm, I, I have to say I don't like Duke. Uh, I respect Duke as a as a foe in basketball. I do in basketball, not in football. But in basketball, I respect Duke. Uh, but I, I don't particularly like Duke. I never have. Uh, although I very very much respect Coach K, and I very very much respect what he's done uh, at Duke the last thirty or so years, uh, give or take. That, that he has been at Duke, and it's, it's completely awesome, and I absolutely love, I mean, he's got 901 wins, or 901, what, 901 or 902, he plays Tuesday night against Michigan State as part of the college football kickoff, or college, excuse me, the college basketball uh, shootout or whatever, I don't know why I went football and kickoff, but anyway, the college basketball kickoff, if you want, whatever. Uh, and there are going to be several games on both ESPNs. Uh, my Florida Gators are playing Ohio State. Big up Florida for being uh, being ranked in the top ten. Uh, of course, the AP poll has them eight. ESPN has them ten. But what are you going to do? They're in the top ten either way. Uh, so I'm hoping that uh, Mr. Sullinger can... Uh, Suck it, and uh, Florida wins Tuesday night. Uh, but that's just the way it goes. Uh, but I gotta say, big ups to Coach K. I know, I know he's gonna win on uh, on Tuesday night. And what a place to accomplish that record! To be the most winningest basketball college basketball coach, and to have the one game where you surpass. Your uh, mentor, by the way, uh, Coach Bobby Knight, at Madison Square Garden. It's just phenomenal. It's just phenomenal. It's it's an awesome experience. And a huge shout out to Coach K. Huge props for what he's done at uh, Duke and with uh, Team USA, for that matter. Uh, but I I cannot. Uh, now I'm probably not going to watch the game. Uh, but I will, I will definitely check out the highlights, and I will definitely uh, congratulate Coach K via Twitter uh, once it once it goes down. I'll keep, I'll be keeping up with it. Let's put it that way. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much all I wanted to say with this. Look, Coach K is phenomenal. Uh, I, there's no arguing that. I mean, he's very well respected. Uh, like I said, I don't personally like Duke all that much, and if Duke ever plays Florida, especially in like the the tournament, then you know death to Coach K is how I'm gonna feel. But uh, on Tuesday, let's just all take take a minute. He's won four national titles at Duke, and, and you know back to back titles is hard to do, and he's done it. So let's just take a step back on Tuesday. After the game, if Duke beats Michigan State, which I'm sure they're going to, uh, because Duke is ranked well, way up there, and 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 Michigan State is, you know, not. But let's just take a step back. Let's take a step back, and let's let's uh, let's honor Coach K. Thank you, Coach K. Hashtag Thank you, Coach K. Or hashtag Congrats, Coach K. Let's just let's just you know. Put, put beefs aside, put everything aside for one night. Uh, on Wednesday, let's go back to hating Coach K if that's, you know, if you're a rival of Duke. Let's go back to hating Coach K. But on Tuesday night, let's give the man props for what he's done. That's all I ask. That's, that's, all, that's what I think us as humans should be able to do, at least for one night. Just, just because, I mean, he deserves it. So anyway, deuces. You guys be good.